kitchen was flooding. That would be scary. Hello and welcome to Avenging Pass 7. This is our Grand Arena video for today, Saturday, April 1st. We're going to start off with the YouTube account. And the YouTube account is going to be a big struggle because they already hit 864 banners. Now we are at, I'm going to reset real quick, we are at 650k GP. We're not very high. So how big is their account? Rather big. 3.2 million. They are where my main account is at. Relic 8 Darth Vader. With 3 Zetas. So I was wrong earlier when I said 2 Zetas. And they've got ships. So... We might not get to do too much here. We'll see what they put on defense. But we might not get to do too much. I mean, at 864, that's probably, what, one one battle per area. Yeah, my big defenses from the previous game did not do much. Yes. Hi. Hi. That will be a tough team to beat. <laughs> no, they cannot. So, all right. We'll go after Phoenix. What is the best Phoenix? counter I'm assuming it's going to be Palpatine Wampa Darth Vader I don't I don't think I've done anything with Wampa on this account and I don't have a great defense so Darth Vader is not going to do much here And what's the old Ben counter? Jedi Knight Revan. Or Bosk. Well, I guess I'll throw Vader up there. But I have not reliced Vader yet, and they got three gear 12s. They've gear 12 the Phoenix team. All right, well, let's... That hurts to do this, because I don't know what's on their back wall. We're going to do it, see how it works. It's our best option. Merciless Massacre. We're going to Force Crush Chopper. I'm going to Basic Hera to Ability Block her. Basic Ezra. We'll basic Zeb, and we'll basic Kanan. 
we will force crush again. That is not enough to take him out, so I'll just basic. We'll basic. I can Merciless Massacre. Basic Chopper. Force Crush Hera. I think I can get rid of Ezra. I can. So we'll Basic Zeb. And Basic Kanan. Alright, so we got rid of one person. Alright, Kanan's Taunting. We'll force crush. Alright, and I'm going to try to get rid of Kanan. I do not, but I weaken him. We'll use Merciless Massacre. Basic Hera. I really would like to get rid of Hera first, but she is staying alive. We'll force crush Chopper. Which healed Kanan. And he is taunting. Can we kill him now? Nope, but we can weaken him. That will get rid of Kanan. Alright. So we'll force crush because they're going to heal off of that. And we'll apply some debuffs. We'll merciless massacre because we got to get some debuffs out there. Because we got to heal up. We'll force crush, get some debuffs, and we'll basic. Alright, they're weakening me, so we're going to heal and get stunned and taken out. He's going to take me out. need to heal up some all right he has backup she finally used backup plan she does not have a counter I'm going to force crush I'm gonna need to heal up crap He's going to counter. Merciless Massacre. And just basic everyone, I guess. There we go. Now we have some health again. We'll Force Crush. Stunned. And taken out. Ah. <sighs> Dude, gear 12 on the Phoenix team? Really? Alright, what can I do here? Because I really don't have much here. I have one, two, three, four. I have five Jedi. That I technically could split up. I could do Anakin and Ahsoka. And I could throw Hondo on there. He's got no mods. But his abilities are, up, are built up a bit. We can try this to take out this team. Alright, so we're going to do that. And Honda's gone. Gonna get rid of... Okay, we're not gonna get rid of that taunt. Can we get buff immunity? No. 
Can we get rid of those buffs? We can. And now he's taunting. We got healing immunity. No buff immunity. Get rid of that protection? No. These guys aren't doing anything. They're not doing anything. We're going to just stop it there before I get... Oh, that's, that's all I could do, really. Now that I broke apart my Jedi team. And we're going to switch over to... Which one will we... We'll go to the alt account first. We will go to the alt account... And we'll see where we're at over there. Maybe we can stand a chance against this team. I know I think I mentioned it in yesterday's video that we're just we're at a tough spot for today with Grand Arena because I think all three accounts are having to punch up against a really tough opponent that we just, we have no right fighting. My alt account has no right to fight a 3.2 million GP account. I'm barely over half a million. Alright, so this opponent's gone to 432. So where, what are they at? 3.3 mil. 3.3 mil. I think this account is just a little bit over 1 mil GP. They put Darth Vader on defense. Okay. So they have not attacked the Geos yet. Now, did they struggle anywhere? I doubt it. Took CLS out just fine. They took Jedi out just fine. Did they even... Did they attempt the ships? They did attempt the ships and got nowhere with it. Okay. So what does this Darth Vader team look like? Darth Vader lead with Boba Fett, Tarkin, Palpatine, and is that Stark? Okay. And I see Bastila down here with the Relic 3 Yoda. 115. Oh man. Alright, let's look it up. Where is it? Right here. Uh, we'll start with Bastila. Bastila counters. That's for 3v3. Uh, General Kenobi, CLS, or C. Well, okay. Well, those... Man... We go give me more. Oh, here we go. Yeah, that's not much more helpful. The only Bastila teams that's pulling up are ones with uh, Jedi Master Luke, Jedi Knight Luke, Watt, Shock T, like big Bastila teams. I don't need big Bastila teams. I I just this is just a basic Bastila team. Um. There was a comment the other day who gave a suggestion, I think, about handling Bastila. Let's see. I don't see it. I really need to start doing these live if I want your, your guys' help. Um, what do my bounty hunters look like? I don't think my bounty hunters look too bad over here, do they?
they might be able to get somewhere with this. They might be able to. I think I just... Ooh, because I haven't finished them out by the time Grand Arena started. That's why. So they do still need some work, and that's why they're going to struggle right here. Yep. Yep. Alright, Bosk. Taunt for me. Y'all start working on... Of course, he's ability blocked. Start working on that contract. We need some debuffs out there. And we fold. There's no point going further in there. Alright. Let's look at this Vader team. It's a Relic 3 Vader. What can I do? What does my Wampa look like? I think it would be pointless to throw Wampa. Because they'll just, I mean, Palpatine can stun, Vader will ability block. I can throw my troopers and maybe get somewhere with this. I can try and throw my Imperial troopers. Alright, we're gonna use that on Dark Trooper. Ability blocked. So, we don't get to remove turn meter. Do we get to ability block? A little bit. Can we take out... We do get to take out Palpatine. We'll take out Stark now. Get that protection up. Or the... Yeah. Go after Tarkin. We might be able to get somewhere with this now. Alright. Tarkin's gone. Vader's Relic 3 is going to be hard to get rid of. But we're getting there. Merciless Massacre. Is he going to wipe the board? Yep. I mean, at this point, I can throw Wampa. I can throw Wampa at that now. Mompo will easily get, take care of that. Never mind. <laughs> Alright, well, we'll swap over to the main account so we can watch the main account lose. We gotta share the spotlight of loss between all three accounts. Because on Wednesday, all three accounts got to win. So today, all three accounts get to lose. Why should it not be that way? It's painful.
It's painful when it's just such a huge difference in GP. I mean, if, if I lose because I make mistakes, it, it, it's, it's why I don't like games like Fortnite. It's why I don't like Battle Royales. Um, you don't get put on an equal footing. All right, so what are, what are we facing off against here? This is a 3.3 million. I'm, I am a 3.3 million account. What is my opponent? 6.3. Twice my GP. Now it looks like so far he's struggled to beat CLS for some reason. Um, what did I have down here? One battle for JKR. One battle for First Order. Alright, so we do have Geos. We do have Darth Vader. Oh, he put Darth Vader on defense. Yeah, that's why. I can't touch that team. There's no way I can touch that team. Darth Vader. Counter. What does Swigo say? Lord Vader. Grand Inquisitor. General Grievous, Dr. Aphra. I don't know if Swagos just giving me bad info, but it's giving me teams that I do not have. I am working on a, on a General Grievous team for the main account. I am working on that, but we're not there yet. There's no point in even attacking. There's no point. We're going to take this, and we're going to go look at my roster. I haven't done a roster review in a while. Um, so we're going to look at my roster. So here's where we're at. We're, at, we're not even at 3.3. We're at 3.1, uh, nearly at 3.2 mil GP. We are on the journey to Jedi Knight Luke. We're getting there. We're very, very close. We really are. We're very close. I'm working on this last piece of gear for Captain Han Solo. Um, I need another 20 of those, and I need another 25, 27 of those. Um, so we're working on it. Slow grind, and then we'll have him at Relic. We'll be able to... I have my Relic stuff built up, saved up, so I'll be able to get him to Relic 3 right away. And then we'll move on to Rolo. And I gotta get her up to gear... Thir I gotta get her relic, and that's gonna take a while. Um, I do have Hermit Yoda, 7 star and gear 12, so that's nice. I'll be able to work on his relic at some point. Lando, I just got a relic up. But the real thing's stopping me. Those, those are stopping me, but those are just taking a while. But the real thing stopping me is Millennium Falcon, which I have at 100 out of 145. Um... That's the real thing stopping me, which we'll go take a, take a look at that. Um, we have Boba Fett looking great. We have Razor Crest looking great. We have the Chimera looking great. What we need now is we need to 7-star the Houndstooth and 7-star IG-2000. And once we do that, this mission, the rest of these missions, I would think should be easy. I would think. You could tell me I'm wrong if I am, but I would think. So we just got to work on those, on collecting those shards, which we're doing. We're getting there. Um, let's see. Collection and ships. You know, it's just going to take a while because, like I mentioned in today's video this morning, um, it takes like three months or so to collect a ship from start to beginning. I think, it, And I think it was three months if you're doing the refresh. A single refresh a day so I'm taking my time I'm happy with where my ships are at because of how much ship credits I earn I've been just like getting every ship up to level 85 just because that way as I want to use them or as I get to where they're in a good spot or I have the team for them they're already at the level their abilities are already maxed out I'm just trying to build up my ships because ships suck 
Um, but I mean, our CLS team is a good CLS team. I mean, look at that. 125k. I could probably, but I actually probably don't want to because it's going to use that. So I do not want to upgrade uh, 3PO. So, you know, like, our CLS team looks really good. Our uh, JKR team is getting there. Now, y'all can tell me. Go ahead and tell me in the comments if you're still watching this far. Um, is this a good CLS team? Or Jedi Knight Revan team? Should I make any edits to it? I'm so glad that I've fallen not using Phoenix anymore. They were my best team for a long time. That's why there was the Omega. I had no idea what it meant. I just did it. My Empire team, I'm starting to work on Royal Guard a little bit and add him into here because I know he will be useful. I've been starting to build up my Inquisitors a little bit over time, especially after last month with how many Inquisitor shards we got. So I've been working on them, building them up a little bit, trying trying to make them more useful for Conquest as I know there are Conquest achievements out there for them. Night Sisters are just there. I don't do anything with them. Resistance I built because when I got Jedi Training Ray, I thought it would be useful and then I just haven't done anything with them. These guys I do really need to upgrade. I just don't use them enough, so I haven't been. The Geos I'm liking. I've been thinking about picking up that Omega because my, my squad, we take Territory War seriously. So I've been thinking about picking up that Omega. And Imperial Troopers, were, I'm getting there with them. They're not where I want them to be, but I think I just finished farming one of these guys, right? Yeah, I think it was Veers. I just finished fin farming Veers, I believe, and so I'm starting to get them where they could be useful. And like I mentioned, I'm um, working on a General Grievous team. I'm farming the B1 now because it's like one of the last useful nodes on ships. And Droidica, I don't even know where to get Droidica shards. Regular energy, I'm not going to waste that right now. I'm too busy farming Houndstooth, IG-2000, and the TIE Bomber. Which, where am I with at with the TIE Bomber? Yeah, so I have them at, what's that, 5 stars. I'm not even going to fight this Grand Arena. I'll just use this as part of a uh, roster review. What's this inbox? Ooh, rewards. Alright, we're getting close to finishing out Darth Treya. That will actually be really nice to finish her, to get her to 7 stars. Awesome. But with that, y'all have a great day, and may the Force be with you.